Welcome to our SWIFT programming tutorial. Today we're tackling an interesting question from one of our viewers. They want to know if they can use the range operator in a guard statement in SWIFT. Our viewer is trying to find an alternate way to check if a status code falls within a specific range using the range operator. They provided an example using a guard statement that checks if the status code is between 200 and 299. Let's explore if this is possible in Swift. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. Let's explore whether we can use the range operator in a guard statement in Swift. First, let's look at the original guard statement you provided. In this statement, we check if the status code is between 200 and 299 using logical operators. Now you suggested an alternative using the range operator. This syntax is almost correct, but there's a small issue. The WHERE clause cannot be used directly in a guard statement like this. Instead, we can use the CONTAINS method as shown. Lastly, you mentioned using a case statement. However, Swift does not support using case directly in guard statements. Instead, you can use a switch statement for pattern matching. In summary, while you cannot use the range operator directly in a guard statement, you can achieve similar functionality using the contains method or a switch statement. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. You can indeed use the range operator in a guard statement in Swift. Here's a practical example. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. You can use a guard statement to check the status code of an HTTP response. This example shows how to ensure the status code is in the 200 range. And that's it. I hope that that's helped find the solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. Every time you hit it, it really helps. Now, I'll see you next time, next time you need some technical help. And until then, have a good one.